Fear number 18, extensive treatment. Quite often patients do not like to get us to get into the details of exactly what they're doing. You know, they say that ignorance is bliss, just do the, do what you need to do and, and get it over with. Um, you know, in certain patients it's best to break down treatment into smaller appointments or some prefer just to, you know, longer appointments, get it all done once, one visit to the dentist and, and, and have it all done. And now that's really down to the individual and it's up to the dentist to, to communicate that to the patient that they, that they have these options. Um, you know, we, we do legally have a, a responsibility to, to provide patients with the information and um, so unfortunately it's not always possible to, to just go ahead and, and do the dentistry um, without them knowing too much about it. They do need to know the procedure that they haven't done, they need to consent to it, they need to know the pros and, and cons of it. So more and more we're having to get into these conversations with our patients. Often patients find these conversations uncomfortable. They trust their dentist, just do what you think is best doctor um, you know and, and we can continue on this treatment um, but you know extensive treatment can incur increased costs and things so again these are all communications that we have to have with our patients and um, things need to be put down in writing um, and, and should be done at the initial examination appointment if a patient just wants to come in and visit the practice see the dentist then it's not a problem for the, the patient then to be re-seen at another time possibly at a coffee shop outside the practice and where they can meet a treatment coordinator who can discuss uh, their treatment with them um, and they, they find that you know at that point they can then read up some information and then be put at ease um, with a dentist and it's nice to see that their dentist is making that bit more of an effort um, than your average dentist would do um, for them to be able to continue on and, and have their treatment carried out.